from London. And here again is Tallulah Bankhead. I've been meaning to tell you about a most charming experience I had the day I arrived at the London airport. I had just landed, and my plane was about to land behind me. <laughs> now I know the way I've been here before. <laughs> anyway, a tall, handsome, distinguished-looking gentleman approached and said to me... I bet you never thought I'd be here waiting for you, Tallulah. Oh, darling, how wonderful to see you. How sweet of you to come. If I'd had my choice of one man in all the world to meet me here, it would have been you. I never expected to see you, dear, dear Wilfred. <laughs> Tallulah, I am not Wilfred. The name is Jack Buchanan. Jack Buchanan, darling, how wonderful to see you. How sweet of you to come. If I'd had my choice of one man in all the world to meet me here, etc., etc., etc. Uh, Delora, I waited 15 long years to see you step off that plane. Oh, I'm sorry, darling. We were held up at Shannon. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you have a rough trip over? Oh, not I. I'm an excellent traveler. I'm in very good shape. Yes, that's the word around London. <laughs> I wrote you when I heard you were coming, but I suppose you've been so busy preparing oh, for a Oh, Jack, you've no idea packing, getting my passport, sitting for my passport painting. <laughs> and then, of course, you know, darling, we all about those inoculations you have to take. Oh, yes, yes, we know. When we heard you were coming, all London was inoculated. <laughs> Uh, isn't he contagious? <laughs> I can't go someplace as I'm cold. That's not the word round London. <laughs> fifteen years. Has it really been fifteen years? That's right, Delilah. And you can imagine what I was thinking when the plane landed and the door opened and out stepped a vision of feminine loveliness. <laughs> but I waited for you. <laughs> No, 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 it was Linda Darnell. <laughs> fifteen years. That's right, fifteen years ago, last July 3rd. No, no, darling, it was July 5th. No, 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 dear, the 3rd of July. The date is indelibly inscribed in my memory. No, Jack, I was supposed to sail the 3rd of July, but I started to stay over until the next day, the 5th of July. But the next day will be the 4th of July. Darling, in Britain there is no 4th of July. <laughs> Delula, I never wrote you this, but I stood here for hours watching your boat disappear over the horizon, little realizing then that someday man would build huge birds of steel to conquer the skies and bring you back to these shores. All I knew that day was that I was desolate to see you sail away over the vastness of the fathomless and mysterious sea. You're making it sound as if I sailed on the Nina, the Peter, and the Santa Maria. <laughs> Tell me, Jack, what's been happening in London since I went away? What's been happening in the last 15 years? Oh, nothing really, no, as a matter of fact. It's uh, been rather quiet, you know. <laughs> but when I was here, it wasn't quiet. I can still hear those champagne corks popping all over town. <laughs> Come to think of it, there were things popping around here in the last 15 years. <laughs> oh, what times we had. Yes, remember those days? I was thinking of the night, though. <laughs> Tallulah, what night, what night do you remember the best? Uh, Sir Lawrence Olivier, to see the card with Sir Ralph Richardson. <laughs> Tallulah, do you remember our last night together? The night I got tickets to the theatre, and then we went to your place. There was something, something I wanted to ask you that night. But either you wouldn't listen or, or I just didn't have the courage. I thought of it as I saw you off in the boat. And for 15 years, I've been waiting to ask you. Oh, Jack, how sweet. Oh, what is it, darling? I paid for the tickets that night. You still owe me seven pounds, four shillings, and eight minutes. <laughs> 